Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you another way to dress up some ordinary flip-flops into cute sandals. To make these sandals, I'm going to use 6.5 millimeter crochet hook and one strand of worsted weight yarn. The first thing you're going to do is make the cuff. To make the cuff, you're going to chain as many chains as you want for as tall as you would like it to be on your ankle. And sorry folks, I've moved outside for light and somebody's mowing their lawn. Single crochet in the second stitch from the hook and in each stitch of the chain. Like that. At the end of the row, chain one and turn. And we're going to do this in the ribbing stitch. So we're going to work in the back side of the stitch only. And we're going to single crochet in each stitch across the row. At the end of the row, chain one and turn, single crochet in each stitch across the row, working only in the back side of the stitch. And okay, you're going to continue with chain one and turn, single crochet across the row, working in the back side of the stitch only, until this cuff is long enough to fit around the ankle. Okay, I've worked my cuff until it's long enough to wrap around my ankle. Like this, it wraps around my ankle. So now I'm going to chain one and turn, and I'm going to slip stitch to the center of the row. And I'm going to chain 25. And fasten off like that. So now on the opposite side, in the center stitch, pull the yarn through, take one stitch with both of the yarns, and then I'm going to chain 25. I'm going to tie a knot in each end of the chain and cut off the extra yarn. And I'm going to weave this yarn end into the finished work. To make the toe end of the sandal, Start with a long yarn end, and then you're going to chain five and slip stitch to form a ring. Chain two. Make three double crochet in the ring. One, two, and three. Chain two and turn. Half double crochet in each stitch across the row. One, and that last stitch is always difficult to find, but it is there. Three. Now every row will be the same. It will be chain two and turn, half double crochet in the next three stitches across the row. One, two, and that last one that's difficult to find. Okay, and you're going to continue this until this section is long enough to reach from the toe to the cuff. Okay, I've made my toe section as long as I need it. So now I'm going to take the cuff section, and this is going to tie on the sides. So I'm going to attach anywhere along here. I'm going to attach this section. Position it in place, and I'm going to attach it to the cuff by slip stitching. You could use a yarn needle and sew it on if you like. like that. So now I'm going to fasten off. I threaded the yarn end into a yarn needle, positioned the end, and I'm just going to sew this section on. Like that. I've attached some beads to a little piece of twine, and I'm going to sew that on. 